ocean acidification is caused by the increasing carbon emissions into our atmosphere. At least one quarter of that carbon dioxide dissolves into the ocean, making the pH less alkaline and more acidic. In the past 200 years, the ocean water has become 30% more acidic. This happens because when water and carbon dioxide mix, carbonic acid is formed. Carbonic acid releases hydrogen ions that bond with other molecules in the area, such as carbonate, the key component in the calcium carbonate shells for animals such as snails, clams, coral, urchins, starfish, and microscopic plankton. This acidic water dissolves their precious calcium carbonate shells and prevents them from forming new shells. Depending on the species, many varieties of coral will have trouble maintaining and building their skeleton. This may cause a shift in coral reef ecosystems to more resistant coral species that can cope with the acidity. In addition to acidity, coral reefs have to deal with gradually warmer waters due to climate change. Coral bleaching is already being seen among many previously thriving reefs. On a positive note, studies have shown that waters with higher acidity actually cause animals such as lobsters, crabs, and shrimp to grow stronger shells. And so far, jellyfish have been observed to thrive in the warm, less alkaline waters. This could cause jellyfish to take a prevalent role in ecosystems around the world in the near future. As for fish, excess carbonic acid in the water can cause a change in the pH of the fish's blood. A small change in pH can make a huge difference. For example, in humans, a change in pH of just 0.2 can cause seizures, comas, and death. Fish will begin using extra energy to try to excrete the excess acid out of their blood. This reduces the energy a fish has left to grow, reproduce, and catch food. Acidity can even mess with their mind. For instance, clownfish can normally hear and avoid noisy predators. In more acidic water, they have been observed to be unreactive to a threatening noise, increasing their risk of becoming prey. They may also flee farther than normal from their anemone home and have trouble smelling their way back and deciphering friends from foe. This could be because the change of pH in their body is altering how their brain processes information. The future may be wary because scientists are still unaware of all the ill effects ocean acidification may cause with time. To find out what small changes you can make to prevent further ocean acidification and climate change, click on the link below. For more marine facts, click the subscribe button.